Hey, well, this is Zachary Triple Seven. Hey, well, it's Zachary Triple Seven here, and today I'm going to show you how to get how to get your own custom Windows Seven boot logo. Now, I suggest watching my previous video. I'll have a link in the description for it. I have my own custom boot logo. I suggest watching that first so you actually understand what you're doing here. It's very simple to do. You download the program and you can have it done in about a minute or two. Okay, so I'm going to provide a link in the description to a download link. Download this program and then this program you can either use your own custom animation or just a picture. So right now I restored mine if you didn't watch my last video, I have my own custom boards and everything. Right now, I just have the normal Windows 7 starting. Okay. Alright, we just have the normal starting windows. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, first of all, this will not work. Also, before you even start, always go and create a restore point. You always want to create a restore point, that way, if you have any troubles, you can always restore your computer and not lose anything. If you do this wrong, it will destroy, it can prevent your computer from starting. So just hit create, and I'm going to name it before change oops, of boot, just for, and just hit create. Let that create. That way, just in case, you can always restore back to that point. So again, make sure on, on this that all these are checked, otherwise this will not work. And once this is done, we'll start to do stuff. This program is actually very nice. You can change a lot of things. You can change the background color. So like right now it's black, right? You can change it to like white. And have like a black background and stuff. It's actually it's a really nice program. Okay, this is done. Okay, this is where the fun starts to begin. Right here is your like preview menu. This is where you can see what you're doing. Now to actually change the logo, this is what you need to do. On our animation, hit animation has a moving like an I believe it's a dot GIF image that has to be we'll check for it has to have a sequence for it to work. So you have to actually have you just select a folder with all the am and and here and here you go. Has to be a full activity dot BMP or 105 frames in PNG BMP GIF or TIF. Now if you don't know what you're doing for that, I suggest doing what I did. I myself just hit static image. Static image is is a very easy. You just could pick any image basically. Just pick a normal image. So I'm going to pick my YouTube account's image. And there you go. Now you should, should check my record there. And that should basically be saying that you have the right image. So now you're going to see, oh, there you go, the logo. Okay. So now you can either check to one message so it doesn't have this right here. Or you can go like no messages. So it's just your, this logo. Or you can go two. Now, message one, this is the little like fine print down there. So I want to delete Microsoft Corporation and put the hacker triple O seven. And I'm gonna leave the size and everything. Now to change the starting window is go to message two and you can put I'm gonna keep this starting and put the hacker triple O seven dash PC. Again, you can always you can change the color to like any color. Since my background's black, I'll keep it as white. Now, go switch over to resuming. Now, it's going to say resuming Windows and Microsoft Corporation at the bottom there. So, I'm going to change it back to the exact same thing as my other one. This is for when your computer resumes. So, if you put it in like to sleep or something, um, it's going to say resuming. So, this is where you're going to change that to something else. Again, go to message two. I'm going to keep the resuming. Now 
Now, in this video, I'm not going to show you guys proof of this working. If you want proof, watch my previous video. I'll have in the description of this actually works. I record myself doing it, so you can actually see it. That is it. So again, you can always you can always play around with the font size and stuff, so you can see it get bigger, and smaller. It's up to you. Play around with it. You know, you can uh, go. I'll try and I'll try and get some links for some uh, downloads to uh, some custom animations. So I I like this static image. So the image does good too. So now this is the fun part. Once you have everything done, we'll all so let's say updating. And once this is done, that's then you're done. So if you have, if you guys have any uh, video suggestions, let me know. And this is what the end for this video. So just exit out and restart your computer. Uh, thanks, Dominique, for the video suggestion. Uh, please send in more video suggestions if anyone has any suggestions. And this is the Hacker 777, and I'm signing off. And don't forget to subscribe.